So. You're watching Fraser Focus, local faces and local places. Right now, we are here at the Pitt Meadows Art Gallery. So much talent here in the region. Hey, this is Wynn. He's an artist himself. Hey, Leah, look at all this cool stuff. What we have here is all arts from the local high schools. And you can see there's quite a variety of talent throughout this whole building. Because you retired, you wanted to come here and uh, get some more work in. And because I, you know, as I said earlier, spent all my life in art. So you work hard there at the art gallery. Now we're heading to yeah, the Yellow we're, Door we're studio. studio. Exactly. Oh, yeah. no. I started when I was eight years old. Wow. My, uh, my lived in Toronto. My mother gave me an oil set and a, a section out of the Toronto Telegram that had a uh, <clears throat> landscape painting done by her teacher and she said here copy this so I did and then I went on to paint for the last 70 years basically self-taught um, even though I've gone to you know three different art colleges but I found I've learned very little in there I've learned more from my uh, peers tell me about a couple of your favorites here okay this is a painting of, uh, of uh, Hawaii um, and the surf is coming in and it's a style that, I, that I've been working on for some time. I have a series of paintings. We've got here one here of the waterfall over the volcanic rock. It's called AK Falls. Uh, we have another one over here that shows the sunset off the Kona Beach in the Ooh, Big Island. I like that one. Kettle Valley Railway up in, uh, up in Peachland. This one is called um, Black Sand Beach. I call this somewhere in BC because I have no idea. It came out of my head one day. That's great, Lee. That's wonderful. What a great <laughs> portrait. Thanks, Wynn. Look at this masterpiece. Hey, look at me. I'm an artist in the making. Stay with us here on Fraser Focus. Keep watching.